Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder EX here with more Let's Play Shining Wisdom. As you can see, I am in the castle where we're going to go to the secret crypt here. Um, one thing I want to show off, I also have um, a instead of a half orb at the top, I have a full orb and I have another full orb with uh, my life stock. Um, if you take the second cave uh, the second creepy cave, the one that says that it's a shortcut to the Sand Labyrinth and East Odagon, um, and don't fall down and walk around to the north, there's a crack in the wall that you can get to uh, that gives you a, a regular regular life crystal, and then there is uh, that tree on the, the freestanding uh, hill uh, next to the, uh, the sand that we were talking about right outside the, the entrance to the castle. And that will give you uh, uh, a livestock crystal. So, uh, we got those. And as you can see, I also have the magic pajamas. There they are. Sleep anywhere, magic pajamas. Yay. Good time. Uh, there is... This is one of two secret labyrinths that we're getting ready to do. I'm not going to do the second secret labyrinth because I hate it. And I've never actually been able to beat it, so I'm not even going to try putting that on screen. So... Um, this is the Royal Labyrinth, and it's kind of a pain. Um, yeah, it's, and by kind of, I mean it's really a pain. So, we're just gonna work our way through this labyrinth. Um, the water here is not shallow water, so don't touch it. It will cause you to fall. Um, this is all, this place is very linear, if I remember correctly. It's all, see, all very linear. Um, what the hell, that, I just broke the game. Alright, so we're going to turn that off and go back to using Ice Orb. And we're also going to use the Jump Shoes. Because that just makes getting through these little sections so much easier. And I don't know... Oh, I gotta fall down there. That's not anything I'm gonna worry about right now. And I can go up here by just jumping. But you gotta use the Pegasus. Nope. Damn it, Mars. Go back. There you go. Bad level design on that part. Jump over you. Alright, so... Yay! So there's no reason for me to go up there whatsoever. Yay, wasting my time. Um... But yeah, so there's a, there's a lot of stuff to this game. And like I said, I wasn't going to get anywhere near... Uh, 100%. But... Uh, damn it, all the bloody pus feeling hell. You guys are just itching to make me waste my time, aren't you? Um, the second labyrinth, the second secret labyrinth, is at the Millennial Tree. Uh, if you remember, there was a, uh... Uh, a vine that wasn't completely full. That vine, if you use the silver bottle, that one, uh, magic medicine bottle, and, uh, use, uh, the sap that you can get from either the, uh, the hermit at the Millennial Tree, or the medicine that you can buy from the hobbits at the Hobbit Village. Where the hell am I going? I don't know. This place seems so ass-backwards to me. Um, plus I'm trying to talk about something that I don't really know what the hell I'm talking about. Um, yeah, so, the only reason why I'm coming here is to get the power orb. You, I get, yeah, you get the power orb through this one. And there's, I can kick that, but that just kind of gets it in the way. So let's go over here and see what going up this ladder does. I really shouldn't be doing this part. I really shouldn't. Uh... Oh, 
<laughs> that was ridiculously lucky. And now we go down here, and this will take us, I believe, to that treasure chest. That Yep. Which gives us the red key. Which lets us come over here to the red door. That was kind of easy. And that wasn't easy by any stretch. That was just sheer dumb luck. Let's go up here and see what we've got going on up here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I game I hate you with the burning passion of a thousand fiery suns. Just so that we're all clear at my level of hatred for you. There was no confusion. Fall down, thank you, turn you off, and just jump. And green key! And of course you have to land on me. Which messes me all sorts of the hell up. And now we get back over here. Now I gotta find the green door. I don't know where the hell that is. I think it's down here. Would you be at all surprised? Nope, nope. I was wrong. I don't know what's over here, though. This is all kind of creepy. No, get off me. Get off. Alright, that was a waste of time and life. As was that. I despise this game with a burning passion. How many times am I going to say that before the end of this LP, kids? Let's make a count. Oh, you... Ah, uh, assy little cock munch. Alright, so there was really no point in that, is there? Now, let me guess. There is a point. That's really where I've got to go. Stop running into me! I'm going to kill you all. Watch this be... I'm pretty sure I've actually got everything that I needed to get over here. Nope, nope, nope. It's starting to wear off. And we don't want a repeat of the last time, do we, kids? Alright, we're just gonna go down. Screw this. I'm pretty sure I'm done with it. I think I know where the the door was. I think it was that first door that I ran into. I hate most of this game. Alright. Really wish they used more buttons to actually program how this game should work. That way you could have more than one thing equipped at a time. Alright, there's the green key. We found that. And power orb. That's all there is to this place, kids. That's it. That's it. At least that's all I'm doing. Screw the rest of it. I don't care. <laughs> I didn't even really need this. I just kind of wanted to get it. To say that I did. There's no other point to being here. None. See? See? That's it. At least that's all we're doing. And that's it. Done. <laughs> I probably missed something. I probably missed a lot of things in there, but I don't care at this point. Alright, so now we're back in the castle. And we need to go talk to the king. So we're going to go do that in this episode, too. Why not? We, got, we just got the power orb. 
We are now imbued with magical energies. All sorts of magical energies. I mean, look at this. I just slid into you. Thank the stars you've returned. Uh, yeah, we know the air. Oh, I've got the air orb. Or blast orb. He oh, I'm the simpleton that failed to stop Pazor. And what were you doing, lardass? We gave it. Oh, them's fighting words, Tubby. Oh, well, the king steps in and smacks him. We were rebuffed. Or is that debuffed? Play a lot of MMOs, it's debuffed. Yep, we did more than your soldiers could. Yep, it's because your soldiers suck. Nope, it's not done. I still have a chance to kill Pazort, because that's really what we've got to do now. we got to kill Pazort. Only one course of action left. Must find each one and send it back to the sealed labyrinth from which you came. So we got to go to the Catacomb Marsh. And Kazen has already gone, I mean, Parn. And see, it messes me up with Parn, too, because one of my favorite anime is Record of Lotus War. The main character is named Parn. And he is a knight. Um, well, he's a free knight. He doesn't belong to any particular nation. Which... Whoa, that was a weird... So we gotta get the Shining Sword. So we gotta go down here. And remember the... The sign that said we have to get the Shining Sword? We've gotta, you know... Find the West Cape and then stand before the, the wall to be judged. Somehow this takes us there. This takes us to the Perilous Pass. And... A record book. Just what I always wanted. Alright. Most of this stuff is just useless. I don't think there's really any item of note here. There may be. We'll look around just to make sure. Oh, yeah. So that's um, where we jumped across, or where uh, Parn jumped across the last time. Oh, I hate those things. The things that stomp down cause you to reset your acceleration. They look kind of creepy, too. Like, they're really weirding me the hell out. Yeah, there's really nothing else here that we need to worry about, so we're not going to worry about it. We're just going to leave. So we head up here, go down the stairs, and leave. And we get creepy music. To the Great Labyrinth. Alright, so the Great Labyrinth... Uh, it has four little teleport spots, which means we have to use them to beat. Um, that'll take us to the four elementals that we have to fight. Terrible power too strong, Pazor lies in the palm of the titan's hand. Alright, so Kazen got beaten. Yeah, he'll be invincible. Go find the elementals and imprison them once more. That's, uh, like I said, that's where the, uh... Alright, this is, uh... Pazort, as you can see, he's in the palm of the, the titan's hand. And I just fell off, because I'm special. Um... And until you defeat the elementals, he'll sit there and shoot different elemental ray blasts at you, and he's invincible. So, yeah. Um, but I don't have the Shining Sword, you say? Hmm. We should probably do something about that. Um, at the very least, I'm not going to do the fights in this episode. I'm going to end it here. Um, and, uh, God, I'm... I'm 
blanking out. I'm going to end it here because I don't want to do the fights in this episode. Um, and even if I have to get the Shining Sword, I've got to go do that first. So we got a lot of stuff that we got to do. More than enough time. Or more than enough stuff to fill another episode. So I'm going to do that. So yeah, I'll see you all in the next installment. Until then, later everyone.